Hey, how's it going, guys? We are still in Underworld for episode 29 of Let's Play Fallout 3 Blind because there's a few things I want to do here before we move on. We move on from our ghoul friends here. So I wanted to get these hollow tapes that are not considered stealing. I've seen two of these here, so I'm gonna... Nothing's going on. We're gonna go ahead and take both of these. And we're gonna see what those are about. I feel like they're probably gonna be related since they're so close together. So this was the first one we took. If you're listening to this recording, it is because you're believed to be trustworthy. I hope that is the case because this recording puts us both in danger. Well, I just stole I'm it, so. I'm escaping from the Commonwealth. You need I'm an android, a synthetic skin. man, a slave. We need more. The men hunting me are ruthless and will stop at nothing to retrieve their property. I need to find a doctor in the wasteland to perform facial reconstruction. I also need someone who knows a great deal about computers. I need... I need to have my memories erased and my face altered like someone else. So that's the Zimmer quest, for sure. That is for sure... This one, the Replicated Man. We still haven't talked to Dr. Preston about it. Okay, well we're gonna do this one sometime. I haven't started it yet, but now that I have a hollow tape for it, potentially two hollow tapes, I feel more of a sense of urgency to do it. We'll listen to this one just a sec. I want to talk to Crowley first. Look who's back. Because we learned some interesting things. Is Tenpenny things. dead? God, I hope so. We learned some really interesting things about him from the Dr. Barrows. So, yeah, the word around Underworld is that there... This isn't what you say it is. These people are not ghoul bigots, as you said. You're a nosy little bastard, aren't you? Yes. It's true. Then Penny is a bigot, but the others aren't. All I want are those keys. Just bring me the keys and I'll give you the full price anyway. How about an extra hundred caps to seal the new deal? Well, that's terrible. That's a terrible way to try to get me to murder for you and steal, is by lying to me. But, you know, that just makes it easier. I don't, I don't know. We'll see. I'll say yes. Good. Oh, and I still want Tenpenny dead. That bastard really does hate ghouls. Well, I don't know about that. We'll just have to see. Uh, do you want to tell me anything about the underworld before I go? It's a place for ghouls. Here, we're just people, not monsters. Yeah, I know. There are too many places where a ghoul can't get a fair shake. Like Megaton, apparently, if you want to ask God. Later. All right, bye. Uh, I don't know how to feel. I don't like that he lied to me, but I don't necessarily dislike him as much as I dislike other people. All right, let's check this one. We now have a lipoplasticator and microdermal graphalizer. We just need to find someone with the skills and willingness to perform the surgery. If anyone knows of a trustworthy surgeon who knows how to keep his mouth shut, send him our way. Also, we <coughs> need to find a circuit neuralizer to reroute the signal into the android's memory. Do you know any trustworthy techies? Okay, yeah, so this is definitely Dr. Zimmer's quest to find his android. And I guess it really is an android. I was kind of thinking maybe it was just a regular escape slave, but if they really are seeking help from doctors and technicians, maybe it really was. I, I don't know. I mean, would a doctor be able to do facial reconstruction surgery on an android because it's synthetic and not real? I don't know. We're going to find out. And we're now here because, as you may have noticed, we crossed the 2,000 caps threshold, so now we can pay uh, our friend here, if you can call him that, and we can get this guy. Ah! Yeah, he doesn't really sound like he wants to be my friend, but mm. I was told that so we'll probably be good friends, so let's try that. Back for more, eh? What can I get for you? You can get me a contract, please, so I can free this man. I knew you'd change your mind. Just remember, Sharon is a valuable asset to me, and he doesn't come cheap. Are you ready to deal? Yes, I'm ready to give you all of my money. Okay, guys, it's our biggest purchase in the game so far, so... Appreciate it. I suppose that could work, yes? <sighs> yes. We're broke now, by the way. Here's the contract. And I'll take my payment in full. I'll give you the pleasure of informing Sharon yourself. What, you don't want to tell him? Hey, uh, okay, Sharon we got it. I was... Go away. I 
just wanted to know. No. <laughs> Dude, there's he's he's so angry. He's such an angry guy. Everybody wants to talk to him right now, including me. I wanted to see I saw that he actually gave me the employment contract. Wow, can I read it? Note, a piece of paper something something something. Wow, that's not a very official contract. I like that I can actually kind of read it though. I can't read all of it. I'm sure it says something oh. funny. All right, Sharon. Talk to. I've just done you a huge favor. Okay. This one sounds way nicer. So hey, slow down there. I have good news for you. I'm your new employer. You purchased my contract from Razrakal. Yes. So I am no longer in his service. Yes. That is good to know. Please wait here. I must take care of something. Okay, take your time. Nothing but I bet he's gonna give him a piece of his mind. Minus five yes. points. What? That's not what I meant. All right, let's go. Sharon. What the heck was that, Sharon? What is this calm option? Like, okay. Like sounds good. No, what what are you what are you doing? As recall was an evil bastard. So long as he held my contract, I was honor bound to do as he commanded. Sharon! But now you are my employer, which freed me to rid the world of that disgusting rat. And now, for good or ill, I serve you. But I didn't tell you to do that. He shot Azrakal. Oh, jeez. I feel really bad. I mean, yeah, he said he was Jesus, a... Jesus, what did Azrakal do? He said he was a corrupt bartender and he tried to get me to kill Greta, but I mean, I didn't hate him as much as other people. Oh, he's a mess! Oh, it's gross. This drink is foul. And that's a ghoul calling something. Are you really concerned about your drinks whenever whenever he's dead? Oh, jeez, Uncle Azzy, I feel like I should say some words, but I don't have any words to say. I'm just gonna loot you instead, how about that? I always did like your business suit, but I'm gonna let you take that one to the grave with you. It's locked for a reason. What do you care? He's dead! What do you even care? These people are amazingly unconcerned. Well, I guess I'm not gonna get all my money back. Where did my 2,000 caps go? Yeah, where did my 2,000 caps go? Uh, well... Okay, how, uh, all right, uh, mm. Ooh. We can, we can do this. No one's gonna care, like he's dead, right? So if I save, can I get in here? I can't believe he's gone. It was almost like it was just a moment ago that he was speaking to me. Because he was. Ah. Uh, Sharon. Okay, we gotta play the minigame. There we go, there it is. Notes on Carol, notes on Patchwork, notes on Slow Flake, notes on Dr. Bear. Unlock safe! All right, let's see what the notes on Carol are. There's something up with her. She's become so moby lately. I wish I knew what it was. She might be a good customer for the special stock. That is, if I could get her away from Greta long enough to work on her. That sounds very sketchy. I'm not really sure what he's trying to do to Carol. Patchwork! I can't say enough good things about this boy. The only thing is, I need to remember to keep an eye on him. I've caught him behind the counter several times. I'd say that he's more trouble than he's worth, but somehow he just keeps coming up with caps for booze. Huh. Snowflake. What is with this guy? <laughs> he just likes haircuts, man. Don't worry about it. Well, honestly, I don't care. He buys up all my jet and keeps coming back for more. It doesn't really matter if he... Insist that he's a barber, I guess. How about the doctor? Note, he has all sorts of good stuff in his office. Are you stealing from the doctor? As he? Well, I guess you're not anymore. I should find a way to get him out of town for a while so I could restock my supply from his. Of course, the egghead never leaves that lab of his, especially since he got that 
passed out smooth skin in there. <laughs> Wait, why do they care? Oh, I feel really bad. Okay, we're not doing this. We're gonna reload that save. Dude, Sharon just gives no dams. That takes care of that. No dams. Why do they care? He's dead. Whatever. Thanks for uh for that. Yeah, he is gonna be a good friend, isn't he? Alright. So I have to find a way to do this when no one's gonna Oh, he's He was dancing with joy for a minute there. See, he wants me to open his safe. Well that's okay, I will open oh the safe. God. Is he dead? What do you think? Okay. Well, I'll just have to find out a way to do that later. Personal space friend. Okay. Well, that was kind of amazing. So he is just going to come with us now. He's like a follower. So he's, he's my follower now. I thought I was just going to free him from slavery or something, but this is way better. This is so much better. Hey, you're kind of scared. What do you need? I need to know about you. Can you tell me, were you willing to? No, he's not willing to tell me anything. Except tactics, what does this do? Is there a problem with what I'm doing? Um, no. No, you're good. If you are through giving orders, then let us move on. He is, like, very serious. Alright, and we can trade with him. Let's go ahead and very do that. Well. Because I'm carrying lots of stuff. I feel like I can give him things to carry. My, I have a couple big guns that are very heavy. And I think it'll be okay for me to give him those as long as I don't give him any ammo. I feel like giving I feel like giving Sharon access to Fat Man ammo would be the worst idea ever. He would probably blow up everything. Okay, so we're gonna give him that. We're gonna give him the minigun. And we're gonna give him the missile launcher. And look how much weight that freed up. We're gonna be able to do so much good things. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Sharon. Also, the option to fire him, I feel like that would kind of free him from whatever this is, but there's no way I'm going to fire him. Did you just see what he did to his last employer? Lord, no. Okay. And I shall follow. And you shall follow, apparently. Thank you, Sharon. <clears throat> I want to get in that safe up there, but I, I need to find a better way to do that. I guess we need to increase our sneaking ability. I feel like I messed with that minigame for no reason. Right, so is that actually everything I wanted to do in Underworld? Because I got a little distracted whenever Sharon went absolutely mad. He went absolutely hammer mode on Uncle Azzy. Well, he must have really hated that guy. Hey, Willow, look who I have. How's the mall treating you? It's treating me great. I have a friend now. Look at him. You What's like up, him? Tourist? Yeah, of course you don't have anything to say about Till it. Till next time, sightseeing. You're probably just pretending like you don't see him so he doesn't go ham on you as well. All right. So I have the Abraham Lincoln things. There's some muties there may be danger over here. there. Thank you for pointing that out. I was just looking at the muties. All right. Let us go to the slave place and give them the Lincoln stuff. That's a very strange loading screen. Yeah! Sharon! He doesn't mess around, does he? I mean, he just straight up just... You're not my employer anymore, are you? Like, okay, then you die. Like, wow. That's terrifying. That's right, the stairs are over here. I still like their indoor cow. He's, uh... Did he always have that pack on him? I feel like that's new. I feel like he was a naked cow last time. But hey, I don't, I don't necessarily remember. It's not like I pay attention to... The clothing attire of cows. I succeed, stranger. Look, they're I having a. To set up a school for freed slaves. Oh, I like you. Caleb, have you been practicing? They're having a nice time here. Let's go ahead and make ourselves a quick save. So the super mutants are dead. This is wonderful news. No, it isn't. Now all you have to do is get Caleb his picture, and we can begin our journey. You don't want to go there. Bad news. Slavers are yeah. The slavers are in control of the memorial, buddy. What? This is a disaster! What? My people are not warriors, but we're all willing to die free rather than live as slaves. Well, that's Our nice. Our plans must go forward. I mean, not if you actually die. When we get to the die, memorial, we will attack. 
thought process is nice. I would be nice. grateful if you would join us. Um, I don't really feel like that's a good idea. I feel like you should just let me take care of it because all of you will die in the process. Like meat shields. But, okay. Right, so I can give him this stuff. So let's go ahead and give him the action it's figure. It's a small thing, but I'll give you ten caps for it. Oh, look, I have a speech option here. Let's see if we can get a little bit more out of him. You take when we have so little. Well, yeah, I just spent all so my money. We will enshrine this right away. I just gave all my money to a dead man. Okay, so since we have a speech option, I'm actually going to say goodbye. May the spirit of the great Lincoln protect you. And I'm going to put on my persuasive jumpsuit. And I'm going to have a bottle of scotch. Because apparently, guys, pay attention. If you ever want to go to a flea market and do some bargaining, you know you've got to drink some scotch to bring uh, up your charisma. It is our newest sister. What can I do for you? I want to sell you the Lincoln stuff. Okay, so I got this poster from the Civil War. Do you want it? The words of the great... Oh, I didn't mean to click that. The words of the great Lincoln something. He's paying us for it. I don't know how much. Okay. Look, we have a... Slightly better chance. Let's do that. Oh, well, we're too poor for that. Oh, come on! I drank a scotch and everything. I'm I'm an unassailable poet with my words. All right, fine. It's a deal. We will enshrine this right away. How about the hat? What a ridiculous hat! Don't I'll insult the hat of the great Lincoln. How could you? All right, you can do better than that. Come on. You take when we have so little. I need the money. So be it. Oh, we're, we're gonna, gonna level up. this right away. We're gonna level up very soon. Okay. Oh, he put it on. Oh, guys, he put on the hat. That's amazing. He kind of looks like a like a dark skinned Lincoln. I think that was probably the idea. All right, I have a collection of pennies with his face on them. I suppose these have some small value to the faithful. I'll give you fifteen caps for it. Please give me more than that. I'm broke. It's not so much more. You have a deal. Yes. All right, are you interested in buying a recording of his voice? I bet you're gonna love it. His real voice? How is that possible? I must have I knew it, he must I'll have I'll give it. you 50 caps for it. Can you give me a little bit more pretty, please? You're right. Here, take your pay. Yes. Imagine, Lincoln's own voice. What a treasure. What an absolute treasure. And we're level up, that's so good. Okay, how about the rifle? His actual rifle? Yes. Such a priceless artifact. And it's in great you condition. You must let me have it. I'll give you 150 caps for it. Please, can you give me a little bit more, please? You're right. I shouldn't quibble over a few extra caps. Yes. We will carry this yes. into war okay. against the slavers. Oh, that's so nice. Oh, he's going to fight with it. I should have fired it at least once. He wouldn't have noticed. Okay, well, how about the wanted poster for his assassin? To think that even the great Lincoln was felled by an assassin. This is a reminder to all that we must remain vigilant. I would like to buy it from you for 50 caps. Can you do any better pretty, please? Oh, we're too poor for that. Well, that's all right. I'll, I'll let you have it then. We will enshrine this right away. Okay, I wonder how much we actually totaled from that. I wasn't paying too much attention. Uh, so how about you tell me about the stone head again? Haven't you been listening? Yes. That's Abraham Lincoln, the or great emancipator. Not. I know. All right, he probably thinks I'm stupid now. Okay, bye, Hannibal. May the spirit of the great Lincoln protect you. The spirit of the great Lincoln. Okay. Da, 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 da. Nice. All right. I wanted some points in lock picking. I just don't want to feel like I'm missing out on loot, but I'm not going to just full haul all my points into that. I want some more points in small guns because I do like the sniper rifle. I do like it. And for my last few points. I want to keep my sneak skill up, especially with the sniper rifle. Also, our explosives is 55. I want to take that back to Megaton and try that that bomb. I want to see what we'll get from the sheriff if we do that. All right, that looks pretty good. Let's continue. And these again. Let's see what's down here at the bottom. What's new? Size matters. <laughs> uh you're obsessed with really big weapons. All right. An additional 15 points. That's pretty good. Scrounger perk gives us considerably more ammunition in containers. That sounds good. Rad resistance. This is kind of like lead belly, isn't it? Yeah, but it's from area resistance or whatever than instead of from water sources specifically. Yeah, we already 
looked at this one, I think. Yeah, I don't want to be neutral, so we're going to be good. Alright, so what do we actually want? I feel like I've been drinking a lot of from water sources, but I also don't feel like I'm super irradiated yet. Well, I'm thinking also we could do this one. If we have higher... If we max out our intelligence, then we could get maximum skill points for leveling, could we? Maybe we'll try that. Maybe we'll just try that. All right. And I'm going to put that into intelligence. Yeah. Let's do that. Okay. And we're done. So many others refuse to help us. Bill Seward. My name is Bill. Bill Seward, if you please, ma'am. Seward. I tried to make it sound less like sewers than you made it sound. Uh, you used to be a slave, huh? Oh, yes. All my life. One day, I killed the master's little girl. <gasps> it was an accident, I swear. What did you do? I... I ran away. They would never have believed me. What did you do to her? Hannibal found me. I would never have made it without him. I want to know how you accidentally kill a little girl. What did you do, like hit her with the lawnmower? Okay, what do you do here? A bit of this and a bit of that. Whatever Mr. Hannibal needs. I look after the animals, cook our meals, clean up, things like that. Alright, you're pretty cool. I already know what the stone head is. Why does it give me the option to ask everybody? I, I'm gonna click it, but... Uh-oh, we're missing an audio file. That's Lincoln, ma'am. Hannibal found it. Oh, I didn't even get to read all of it. Well, that was my impression of Bill Seward, everybody. Alright, bye. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Hey, four score. He's cuter. Bill, I have some sewing he for you. Are, his, my room. are his uh, eyes different yes, colors? Sir. That's right away, sir. Collar back on you. Everyone talks over each other. Hate guns. Besides, okay. the pen is mightier than a sword. All right, so is Caleb out here? He is. Hey, Caleb. You have a picture. And such a large one, too. Does this help you? I'll have no problems restoring the memorial with this. Thank you. All right, Caleb. You're welcome. I can ask him about the face, too. Like, why can I ask everyone? I know what it is. It's the head of Abraham Lincoln from the memorial. We're going to go put it back on the memorial. I know what it is, but I'm going to ask anyway. The stone head is from the statue of Abraham Lincoln. Wowie, shock and awe. Hannibal wants me to reattach it to the statue Shock the and awe. <laughs> it's not like I didn't already know okay. this for a long time now. All right. Hello, ma'am. How goes your studying today? So what are you thinking Everything now? Everything is done? I can hardly believe it. We are finally going to realize the dream. Realize the dream. We'll start dream. out within the hour. We'll meet you at the site. Oh my goodness. I've been reading about Abraham Lincoln. They're leaving already? A very great man, Bill. A very great man. You know, I think if they leave, we could probably come back here and go through some of their rooms and see what they left behind. I wonder if they'll leave anything worthwhile. I want to get in Azrakal's safe. I also can't believe Azrakal is dead. You know, life comes at you fast. Good day, ma'am. Good day. Good to see you. Look, they're getting ready to go. That's why the cow had the pack on it. Maybe it always had the pack on it. I don't really know. But yeah, they're going. Are they going to get hurt? Like, is there any possibility of them having trouble on the way there? Do I need to go with them? They said just to meet them there, so... I'm thinking we should just... Sorry, I just had the realization that he kind of... Like, they're the same color. They have the same same skin. Is that why you were looking at the cow? Were you like, wow, I understand your problems. Probably not. You're, you're a really interesting guy. Okay. So we're supposed to go meet them there. Let's see what the quest actually says. Kill all the slavers and meet him at the monument. If we get there before them, could we clear the monument for them so they don't have any trouble? I'm just worried that they're all gonna die. Let's go ahead and travel there. Oh, we can't travel from in here. That's right. That's right. How far out do I need to be? Is this far enough? I agree with you. That's that's how I always feel on the inside. All right. Memorial. Really? I'm not far enough out? Let's go a little further. I can't see anything. How about this? This is surely far enough, right? Oh, maybe we should turn the light off. Right. Er, uh, I guess I could just not kill all of them and just kill some of them. So, oh, that was a scotch wearing off. I was wondering what was going on. 
I would rather this assault happen at the daytime and not at the nighttime. So they're here. Let's look at the local map. So, okay, that's... What? I'm a little confused about what it's pointing me to. So, is that where I'm supposed to meet them? Is over there? I wish it was daytime. Can we wait until daytime? What are the chances of us waiting until daytime? Let's try it. We'll have an auto save if we need to undo it. Five should be long enough. So exciting! Watching the time count down till daylight. Alright, there we go. This is much better. And actually I'm going to end it here because it's about that time. And yeah, so we're going to do this very exciting slave revolt revolution thing at the Washington... Not Washington Monument, that's that. At the Lincoln Memorial. I know what our landmarks are. Next time! So yeah, thanks for tuning in, guys. Really happy about our angry sidekick. Uh, yeah. See you soon.